Greetings, everyone. Welcome back. Yeah, whatever. To more of Metal Saga. Where we're gonna do some stuff. Anyways, Foreverland. Let's talk to the kitties here. Is it just me, or did Fallout 3 kind of copy off of this place? With, uh, was it the one cave area? What was it called? Uh, Crab, little lamplight. Where it's an underground bunker complex full of kids. Hey, Spitz, how's it going? Yeah, not bad. Yeah, same here. Oh, hi, Spitz. Uh, it's not much, but please make yourself at home. Are you kidding? This place is great. You have like your own freaking high tech, like, bunker complex. <laughs> <laughs> long, long ago, there was an orphanage that was destroyed by fire demons. The director perished in the flames, along with her entire staff. But before she died, she entrusted the care of the children to the eldest boy. He, in turn, managed to hide the children until the demons returned from whence they came. When all was safe, the eldest boy led the children from their hiding spot. They could not return to the only home they ever knew. And so stench of death lingering in the air. They left the charred remains of the orphanage behind and headed west. There they wandered from town to town, begging for food and shelter. The size of their group grew as they adopted the runaways and homeless children they encountered along the way. Tired of living in the streets, one day the eldest boy decided it was time to find a permanent home. Hmm? What happened to them, you ask? Well, when they got to the bottom, they went back to the top of the slide where they stopped and turned and went for a ride till they got to the bottom again. <laughs> Kid, you're freaking creepy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at that freaking Vulcan candy. I don't want those. Well, now we know the backstory of the town. Ah, there it is! Hello! So you noticed this hunk of junk, huh? It's been sitting here for a while now. I've been meaning to fix it, but I don't have the parts. I need a lot of scrap metal. I tell you what, you bring me ten tons of scrap metal, I'll fix it up good as new and sell it to you. Hold on! Where do I get scrap metal? Machine sells blah blah blah. Talk to Robbie and she's got a little tank. You don't need a lot, just 10 tons in exchange for receiving a little tank. Obtain scrap metal from exchanging ore with the trader in the garage at Alice One. How do I get ore? But, but where do I get ore? Oh yeah, we need some of these. Okay, that's good. We'll get four of those right now. Oh, where do I get ore? I want this tank. I, I need this tank. It's not that I want this tank. I need this tank. Frickin' ore from. I don't care about frickin' big battles. Why 
why do I wear this? Um, well, I was injured when I was younger, and the wound didn't heal properly, so I have an ugly scar there. It's kind of embarrassing, so I wear this to cover. Kid, you don't need to wear crap. Thunder Puncher. That sounds like fun. <laughs> Crimson Knife, Kevin Wig. Another bio jacket, trigger bracer. Legendary memo. Lord, how deep is this bunker? It's playing town music, so imagine there's a shop somewhere. Omega Blaster. Junk. Kevin Fast. Man, you kids are friggin' loaded. You're a hunter, right? Cool. When I grow up, I'm going to be a hunter, too. As a hunter, I'll be able to make enough money to take care of everyone. Yay, Spets! You have a sister, right? Do you ever worry about her? I'm always a nervous wreck when my brother leaves. That's nervous. The Blue Moon. Blue Moon, I think, is actually like a lightsaber. It says it's a beam weapon. I was looking through my inventory when I was selling crap earlier, and I went, ooh. I'm gonna hang on to one of those. What's wrong with my hair? What do you mean? My hair always looks like this. Even if I wet it down, it sticks back up when it dries. I know the feeling, kid. Dude, armor level five. A dog laser. Dude, you're about to get freaking jacked up, baby. <laughs> this bunker keeps going. It doesn't end. Oh, here's the teleport. Okay. So, we have loots. You always get first dibs. Cloud Jack stuff is good. Trigger Bracer is definitely better. <laughs> and you go ahead and get your Kevin that's put on. You oh wait 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 <laughs> shoots out a boxing glove are you freaking kidding me I'm half tempted to put this on him because he's kind of getting out of date with his well no he's not out of date the boomerang is still hanging in there it's me that might need to switch out something because this thing. Yeah, I'll put that on. And you can keep what you got because it's still really good. Oh, that's right. Well, hold on. If you, you've got the mechanic gloves. They're still really good. I'm going to swap that out. You don't need that because your armor is freaking ridiculous for not boost the air. Yeah, you take them. You need all the armor you can get. I mean, my defense is woeful right now, but he needs it. Uh, let's see. Now I'll get the Omega Blaster. I 
Oh, that's right. Douge weapons. I almost forgot the douge. Diamond douge. There you go. So I should have named the dogs Dee Dee. Beam rifle. The dog has turned into a Gundam. Oh yeah, definitely worth coming here. Okay, I have got to figure out how to get ore. I mean, I'm reading up on the strategy guide. It says you trade ore for scrap metal. And it says it's not hard to do. But where do I get ore? As soon as I know where we get ore, that's where we're going. I'm going to look this up. Okay, we're gonna get a couple. Okay, let's see. Once you discover, scrap. Still not telling me how to get this scrap. Oi. Cycle? Oh, shoot, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. Let's see. So I need to go learn recycle, eh? That won't be hard at all. I'll just go buy crap, sell it, or buy buy crap, turn it into scrap metal, and boom, there we go. Alright, we're about to get us a verbal wind. And then I want to go get another vehicle. So this is going to be vehicle day. We're going to upgrade some stuff because our tanks are getting really, really out of date. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm going to keep the Gepard around. The other two are going to go. Alright. Port! Mouse one. 
I need to go see a man about a recyclability. Which hopefully he will have. If not, then we're going to Bel we're going to East Zero, then to Beldair. We're gonna go check these guys out and see who has the recyclability. And then I will buy junk parts in a town for tanks and just start scrapping the heck out of them. To get all the scrap metal. So this won't take long, I'm just gonna find out where this guy is. He has the ability that I want. He has it, okay. I guess, yeah. You. Um, I really don't need that. Now, um, well, what can I buy up here and how much does it weigh? Over here. I could go back to junkyard and do scrap stuff, but I'm too lazy to do crap like that, so. Ten tons of scrap, huh? Just buy two of these. That should do it. I'm not sure how much scrap we got. Out of it. Every time I want to do that, that's ridiculous. Alright, so we're gonna buy the cheapest thing here then. Four of those. This is worth it. It's totally, totally worth it. Seven tons, regardless of what I'm doing it with. So I could have bought something a lot cheaper and gone to another town, but. Eh. Okay, so how much scrap metal do I have now? I'm bleeding money, but yeah, it's. I might have enough, actually, I'm thinking about it. 3.4, 5 5.1, 6.8, 8.5, 1.2. Okay, so we got the tenth of the scrap. Let's do it! Time for a massive, massive upgrade. Oi, oi, oi. Get back in your freaking tank. No, get back in your tank. Where is the D bag? Useless. Freaking half trap. God dang it. Yeah, 
I just spent a lot of money getting this thing. Hey! I can see you got scrap metal. Can I have it? Put it to good use. Okay, that's a total of 10.2 tons. This is about 10 tons. This should be enough. It'll take a while for me to finish the repairs, so come back later. You're gonna make me just leave the town and come back, aren't you? I hate it when games do this bullcrap. They're like, you gotta come back later. It doesn't say how long, but you leave the town, come back, and it resets the trigger, and it goes, hey, you have a tank now. I'm all done with the repairs, so about the price. I'll sell it to you for twenty thousand gold. What do you say? What? You think I'm trying to rip you off? Well, it is an anti-aircraft tank, isn't it? I don't think that price is a bargain. Yeah, but I just spent like 80 grand converting this thing. Alright, I'll take it. Okay, it's all yours now, and thanks. But this will keep us fed for a while. The Werbel Wind! Yes! Oh! Oh, good. Okay, here's what we gotta do. Drive. You go away. I don't want the word one. Here, you guys can keep the half track. I don't need it anymore. Have fun with it. Half track is dead to me. Dead to me, can't open up. Okie dokie. We need to go and outfit this thing. Show. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do actually is equip said weapon. What do you have for pots? Oh. oh! You actually got really good stuff right off the bat. So we just need to go get you guns. Where do we find guns? Well, we gotta go to Toy Kami actually. So who am I going to give the Werble Wind to? Me! Me will get the Werble Wind. And Charlene will get the Gepard, and What's-His-Face can keep his freaking light tank, because it actually kind of works out for him. Um, but yeah, the, the Stug's got to go. It is overly complicated and everything else. Let's drive. Exit. Exit. Stop telling me. You are going to get the camper. I'm going to get the rubber wind. And we'll tell the story. We're good, we're good, we're good. So, what makes the werewolf wind so ridiculous? Well. We can get 130 mil, 230 mil, 330 mil. 430 mil. It has four mounts. Not even kidding. Not even kidding. Whoops. Wrong me. There's me. So we're going to install main gun one, main gun two, main gun three. And main gun four. I may find some better 30 mils, but until then, this is what we got. Yeah, yeah, you can lose, it. You can lose your weight. But that's all I'm putting on the warble wind. It's just gonna have four main cannons and it's gonna rip through everything like a hot knife through butter. And now, we need to go to Beldair and upgrade. Oh, yeah, this is the thing. Woof.
Speaking of upgrading and things, I gotta change the oil in my car. Can't do it today because it's freaking raining. But I could probably, I'm most likely to be able to do it tomorrow. It's supposed to not be raining tomorrow, so. And if not, I still have plenty of time to get it done, so. But I have the Werber Wind! It is the best tank in the game! Well, one of the best. Arguably the best. I think it's the best. But we're gonna. This is an end game tank. So we have one of the end game vehicles. We're about to get another one here. Or at least one close to it. Um. Yo, dog, we totally mod your vehicle and we're mod for the mod and the mod. Their ability is really good to upgrade on this thing. Oh, that's good. Max ammo and all the ammo. The Rudolph engine. It's a good engine. unit for a bit. There we go. These things. More full attack upgrades. All the upgrades. It's going to cost a bit to get this. See, it's a good thing I had all that money. I've blown through almost a hundred grand already on this thing. Small price to pay for one of the best vehicles in the game. Problem is though, it's not going to have very good uh, armor class. I mean, the engine's good on it. it comes with. It. But it ain't really gonna be able to hold up very well with all these mods and stuff on it. Okay, so it is fully modded out. Okay, we're gonna lose half our armor tiles, that's fine. Now, back to Alice 1. Horrible win! Yes! Can't wait to get some better freaking guns for it though. Ooh! Get a new engine, new guns. It's gonna be sick. Okay, so we gotta head west. Now we have got to be careful out here because this desert is nasty. Okay, make sure the map loads up. Tiamat is out here, and I do not want to. I do not wish to run into and fight Tiamat. But there's a shop out here that we need to go find. Oh, I didn't equip a sub weapon. Ah, oh, well, whatever. Okay. Oh, and I didn't rearm it. Crap. Okay. Well, I can get a sub weapon easy enough. The Stug has one for me. Yeah, AA tanks are a little ridiculous. Okay, so I forgot to put this thing. In the pot, try no meter Vulcan, transfer. And Oh, I 
gonna drop more weight. Oh gosh, I got no armor tops left on that thing. Oh jeez. Ah, there's the shop I'm looking for. So here is where we're gonna find our next. Oh crap, this video's going over. Oh well. Wow. Here's gonna help you. If you have junk, I can appraise it for you. Praise away. Unknown junk, huh? Look. So what you ate. Flashlight. Snake trigger. Have you seen those gluteus maximum freak fanatics around here? They're really starting to get on my nerves. They're supposedly all about physical training, but I don't buy it. Rumor has it they've been buying an expensive high-tech machinery. What do you suppose they need that for, huh? No, there's something fishy about them. Mark my words! Haven't found much worth selling in a long time. Now, one guy sells an item I need to buy here. We haven't found many strange things lately, so that means we don't have anything to sell. Oh, yes you do. You have something I want. I'm gonna go over some time in this video because I wasted a bunch of time at the beginning. Griping about freaking where do I get an ore from? Where? There we go. Um somebody's supposed to sell something here. Oh my gosh, I have to do the oh freaking game. I actually have to do the trigger. This is dumb. This is so dumb. Why is it so dumb? Why is this a dumb thing? Alright, well let's save us some time. And to not run into Tiamat. I'm thinking about it. We could maybe take. No, no, no. No, I'm getting way ahead of myself. TMAT's like end game crap. I was like, maybe I could take on the freaking giant land cruiser of doom, but no. No. Let's see, I forgot to rearm this thing. There we go. Now the whirlwind is fully armed and ready to kick the crap out of everything. It can single-handedly win fights. That's how good this thing is because of the four AA guns. It's probably the most broken AA gun in War Thunder. The turret turns way too fast for a hand cranked turret. this guy. Yeah, man. What a bargain. Good. Hunter's Department goes to can, make some money, let's go to Trader Camp, go buy a bus sign. That's what he wants me to do. I got some honey to sell. Okay. 
off that crap thing. I kind of want to see the dude just beam laser. I think it's going to be freaking sick. Alright, back to the trader camp in the west. And then we'll go get us a bus. Oh my gosh. Well, we're not going to get the bus of this video. I'm going to save that for next time. Because you actually have to wait five minutes, like legit five minutes for a bus to come. After you put the stop sign down. And then it'll it'll let you do the thing. Maybe we'll get some bike jump on these guys. Yeah, get that appraised. See what we get out of that. And then I gotta go back to Junkyard and I gotta drop off a bunch of this crap that we're getting for assembling parts. Please, no Tiamat. Please, no Tiamat. Okay, whew. It is in this desert somewhere. I would rather not fight it right now. Alright, guys. Let's see here. I think this guy's one so silly. Oh. Yes. Get an eagle eye. Huh? Eagle eye, okay. Crap. Shut up! Stop talking! Uh, three thousand bucks. Got me a bus stop soon. Place in the desert north of here called the bus stop. Uh, why don't you try using that over there, eh? Eh? Hello, Thunder. Alright, well, I need to stop recording because it's getting ready to start storming. And make lunch. So, I will catch you guys next time on Let's Play Metal Saga!